Our team coverage continues right now in New Haven at 6, where Air Force Two landed earlier today. Channel 3's New Haven Bureau Chief Matt McFarland is telling us how this visit is making a big impact on residents there. You can see the, the plane still, she's still here, Matt. I see her ride home. She is here. That ride is here. There's also pizza inside for dinner when she gets here. You know, uh, it's quite the sight here. Air Force Two, as you said, the vice president is on her way back here. And all afternoon, folks have been stopping here, snapping pictures. You can see uh, plenty of folks have now come back here. They've showed up. They're waiting for her arrival to see her departure. And it's that plane and the passenger, the vice president, that continues to turn out quite the crowd. With their homemade signs welcoming the vice president to their hometown, eight-year-old Dresden Theodore and his little sister Maya were hoping to catch a glimpse or maybe even a wave. We're excited for Kamala Harris to come and land at this airport. We're close to where we live. But for their mom, today's trip means so much more. Kamala Harris has the same uh, ethnic background as my kids. She's South Indian and um, black, and so are my children. She says Vice President Kamala Harris' visit is a chance to show them that anything is possible. While security was tight, and there were a few supporters of former President Trump in the crowd, most who lined up for hours along the fence line at Tweed New Haven Airport, waiting for Air Force Two, wanted to celebrate its history-making passenger. It is the first African-American female in office as vice president, and I feel like it's a very big moment for everyone. But for Gaia 3, Vijaya Kumar and her kids, that connection means so much more. For my kids, I'm just so excited that they can find somebody that represents them. I mean, my, my husband and I were born, we're American citizens, my kids are, but they have brown skin, and it's just exciting for them to know that somebody, the vice president, looks exactly like them. You know, as the crowd was clearing out earlier this afternoon before they started to reform, one spectator said, spectator said no matter what side of the political aisle you're on, uh, they said this is a pretty impressive sight just to see Air Force Two and all the preparation and the security that goes into a visit just like this. We're live with the Mobile Newsroom in New Haven. Matt McFarland, Channel 3 Eyewitness News. Matt